DreamHack Summer 2013 will be taking place from June 15th through June 17th, where eight of the best teams in the world will compete for $30,000 in the title of DreamHack Champions. To find out two of these teams, qualifiers were hosted for the North American European region over an eight-day period with over 100 teams competing for this opportunity. Results would start to get interesting with a round of 16, which would also be the start of the double elimination format of this event. A new team in Yeah would face off against Absolute Legends. Team Yeah would take the series two games to one, knocking AL down to the loser's bracket very early on. Another the big line stun from Mavis coming out on top of that torture is dropping pretty quickly though. Now comes a the eruption gonna be channeled. The eruption gonna be used by Mavis rather the elemental war gonna pull him in there. Uh, Alunas gonna end up falling in the artillery barrage on top of them, however. In comes another Magnus stun. Torture obviously is dead. He is not buying back. Dimension Shaman trying to live this whole time. A breakable goes off. Not gonna be enough though. Magnus eventually falls. And that might have done it right there. LRM slowing down on Philia, trying to finish him off. Down goes Nifora. It is just Magnus and Ophelia right now holding off the base. Torture is not up for another 45 seconds here. And here we go with the melee racks. Continuing on with the round of eight, Internet Gangsters, which was a new team consisting of Insania, Sender, Noob G, Fuzi, and Exibe, would take out Q Squad 2 0, making a statement that they were ready to play. After getting knocked down early, Justice League would match up against Q Squad in the loser's bracket round two, a team they knew very well. Justice League would pull off the upset over Q-Squad, which would not only knock Q-Squad from the event, but they would also announce shortly after that they were disbanding. Justice League would continue their momentum and take out another strong team in Yeah the following round, however found their better in Lion Esports Club shortly after, losing two games to nothing. Back to the winner bracket, Complexity matched up against Internet Gangsters and this series would prove to not disappoint. Already filled with plenty of anticipation, drama occurred right off the bat as Complexity randomed their first lockpick hero in Pharaoh, and IG would refuse to remake. After losing the first game, Complexity would play with a chip on their shoulder and take a very convincing game two to push it to the final game. Drops the Shadow Shark gonna explode right there, Torture taking the brunt of the damage, the minions are in some trouble. Rally thinking about, what is Rally doing? He's going back in head smash. Rally, stop! Fousey's making some mana mode plays right here. Oh, the Compel completely misses! Doesn't it anybody? The Kel field comes out though from Bubbles in the flank. They're just kind of toying with them now. Game three had a very risky pick from Complexity with Oogie despite going up against a Fade and Mage Vein. Early on, Complexity would look very good. However, they could not break into the base and Internet Gangsters would eventually rally back to take the series. Complexity would find themselves needing to fight to not only go to DreamHack, but get a rematch against Internet Gangsters in the loser's bracket finals. Complexity would look very good against Absolute Legends, winning that series two games to nothing, and then continue their momentum against Lion, taking them out two games to nothing as well. Complexity would get their storyline rematch against Internet Gangsters, and to add to the suspense, the winner would qualify for DreamHack Summer 2013, and the losing team would be done. In Game 1, Internet Gangsters would draft a very strong lineup, and Complexity just could not get around it, putting IG up 1-0 in the series. Once Game 2 finally came around, Complexity would respond and take it tying the series at one game apiece. It would come down to a final game to determine who would be joining Stay Green from this event at DreamHack Summer 2013. Internet Gangsters would draft a very strong Flux Engineer combo with Dark Lady to carry. However, Complexity would get the better start. IG would hold as long as possible knowing Dark Lady could carry the late game, but Complexity was relentless with their attacks, and it eventually broke through, sending Complexity to DreamHack Summer 2013. Congratulations to both Stay Green and Complexity on earning their spots at DreamHack Summer 2013 event.